What's up everybody, welcome back to part 5 of Resident Evil 7 Biohazard. I am recording another episode, I'm doing back to back. Yeah, it's, it's, it's just, I'm, I kind of hooked. Um, yeah, last time, or five minutes ago for me, uh, we, we unlocked the front door. We got the final head for the Cerberus lock, and we... We placed that in. We also got the scorpion key lock. So I'm not sure what other doors are unlockable. Actually, maybe we'll do that. We'll do that first. Uh, we'll kind of have a look around, see what other doors we can kind of unlock in the area first. Uh, and then we can go and go outside, which I think is going to be like a whole new area. Um, so it's going to be kind of like the mother's domain. Um, and she's going to be like the boss for that area, I think. Um, so yeah, I'm not gonna kind of ramble on too much because I just want to get back into it. Um, but before I do, uh, if you guys are st stuck around for the la for the end of the last video, thank you guys so much. Um, but uh, if you didn't, I kind of want to reiterate, uh, bring bring up some of the stuff that I mentioned at the end of the last video. Um, I. If you guys like the breakdowns that I do, or I say breakdowns, like the kind of, um, when I kind of describe kind of maybe how the game mechanics work of the games that I'm playing, uh, and give you kind of like a little bit of insight behind the mind of the, uh, game developers that, uh, what they were thinking when they made this kind of, uh, why certain decisions are made in games and stuff, uh, definitely let me know down in the comments because I kind of want to steer my content more towards doing that sort of thing for you guys. Uh, as a game developer and a person who plays games, I love kind of seeing what other game developers do and kind of getting into their their mindset as to, oh, they did that for this reason or I wonder if that's why they did this and like that sort of stuff and kind of explaining that. So if you guys are really interested in that, um, let me know uh, in the comments below. Uh, or just uh, leave a like on this video also helps you know that you like this sort of content. Uh, because I want to do some more of that. And I'm also thinking about doing some uh, other videos where I kind of like break down uh, game mechanics and stuff from games. And kind of give you a little bit of like a more behind the scenes look at that sort of stuff. So if you're interested in either of those things, please let me know in the comments. I really would like to know. So yeah, but that's enough with that being said, let's get back into the game with part five. Uh, ooh, no, we want to stay in the game. Uh, and before we go outside, we're going to, oh, it's my own character breathing. Dang, you make him <laughs> still freaking me out. Um, well, we're still bursting with adrenaline from that fight. Let's kind of give a look around the house. Let's see if we can use this scorpion key. I think upstairs might have been a room. So let's have a look. Also, the grandmother. The grandmother moved. Wait, what one is this? This is a snake, right? Yeah, okay. I think, I feel like we're a little bit safer to explore. I'm not sure what we might find now that the, the dad is likely dead. I don't think they're going to put him back up here. At least for like a little bit. <laughs> or, or we trigger a whole different segment to the game before it's supposed to happen. Yeah, see, here we go. Yes. Okay, so we're gonna a new area. Oh yes! Wait, wait now. Oh, is this a different type of shotgun? Broken shotgun. We switch the shotguns. Okay, that's what's gonna happen. Which the broken one for the fixed one. Hey, yeah. all right. Uh, put that back. Ammo, yoink. Okay, what's this? I'm tired of chasing all of these shitheads around the yard. Uh, the next time one of our guests runs away, uh, hide the dog head beliefs so that they 
uh, so that they can't get out of the house. Let's hide them like this. Living room. Ah. Oh. Wait, did we do it bef in the opposite way? Because we found the grandfather clock one already. Hold on, let's reread this. Um, the book in the recreation room. And uh, yeah, which was downstairs. Uh, and the discretion, uh, just dissection discretion room. <laughs> you, di you need discretion when you when you go into that room. Um, the dissection room in the basement. So I think. I think we were supposed to get the Cerberus head first downstairs, and then if we hadn't found it, maybe then we get this? I don't know. I don't know. But we might be doing it in a different order, but that's kind of cool that you can do that. Um, okay. Mrs. Baker. How have you been feeling recently? It's been a long time since you came in in for your last checkup. I'm writing to tell you that I finished examin examining your x-rays. Uh, those dark areas in your cranium are fungus-like structures. That's wait, wait a minute, is this... Is this The Last of Us? I haven't actually played it, but I'm aware that like in The Last of Us it's like a fungal type... Um, disease thing that makes everyone zombies which by the way I'm gonna be doing a series on the last of us uh, there's rumors of the uh, the second one coming out on PC so I'm thinking I think I think I might have actually announced it officially I'm not sure um, but that's gonna be coming out so I'm thinking leading up to that I might do uh, well I haven't played the the first one so I'm gonna play the first one uh, and then when the second one comes out, then I'll obviously do a series on the second one as well. Um, so yeah, stay tuned uh, for that. Uh, I know that that's a popular popular game. There's a lot of people that love it. So, and then and then I can probably actually watch the TV show. I watched a couple of, I think I only watched the first episode, maybe, uh, of the series. Uh, people said that I could watch it. Uh, without playing the game, so uh, I didn't end up continuing on with the series because I kind of wanted to play the game first, but I don't know. I don't know. Maybe I'll maybe I'll watch the series, play the game, and then when the second one comes out on PC, play it like that. So we'll, we'll see. We'll see. Maybe I'll do a reaction series. Uh, yep. Yeah, if you want to see that, comment below um, for that. Uh, okay. So it's a fungus. Oh, did I finish reading it? Oh, so that's why we slowly turn. The inhalation and noises you said you've been hearing may be a result of these growths. Does it make sense? It's in your head. You... Oh. Oh, man. Can you imagine that? Like, just... Ooh. It's kind of feeling like things growing in your skull and kind of hearing that. Nah. Ah, God, why did I have to imagine that? Oh, damn, that's some... That's some... I did not want to... I did not want to picture that. Is that a... Lamp? Ah, I'm still, still cringing from that. Alright, what else? What else do we find in here? Okay, I think that's everything. I'm gonna make it sure. Right. Yeah. Oh wait, was there a second page? Uh, if your symptoms are due to a fungal parasite, it must be removed before it's too late. I don't mean to scare you, but I'm seriously concerned for your health. Please come to the hospital as soon as you read this letter. As your doctor, I strongly recommend you undergo further tests. Uh, Crawford Lang? Um, okay. Well, either she didn't make it there in time, or she said, Screw you, I'm not. I have a fungus in my head. 
I know that some some people are stubborn when they when there's ah uh, when there's medical things that kind of go into denial. Wonder what kind of p patient she was. Okay, so we got. Then that. Can we do it again if we have the tape? Oh, we don't have the tape. Oh yes, the shotgun. I almost forgot. All right, what's in here? Gunpowder. Casually sitting on the bin. So that one. I wish the the escape key was just kind of to exit out of any in interface. As well, that would be nice. So I, I hit it by default. <laughs> it's like muscle memory. Oh, I'll take that. Billy King, Jazz World. Is there anything in here that we missed? Nope. <clears throat> Alright, so... We have those other rooms down the hall. I know where that leads out here. Oh, we got another. Oh, the lockpick. We used it up. I wonder if there's another one around. <coughs> Let's have a quick looky. That's that room. Okay, so it's only the snake room. That's left in here. We need like a snake, snake key. Okay, so we've pretty much got everything. Snake key, and then there's the the crow key as well, which has us going all the way downstairs. So, all right, I think we're good to go outside now. I don't know what this is for. Let's go outside. See what we got. Oh yes. <laughs> Man, I almost forgot again. Don't take the shotgun because oh. Okay. Uh where is that room? Oh, we can go this way, can't we? Let's actually save it. Don't scare me, please. Let's do a quick save. You save. Yep. Alright, let's see what we can store in here. Uh, we don't... So, the way that this works, I'm assuming, is like... Anytime you see the storage box, you can kind of grab anything out of it, so... I don't think we need the scorpion key yet. But... Yeah, so I'm gonna... I'm just gonna store that in here for now. Uh, and I, I'm gonna store this, just because I don't plan on using it yet. I feel like that's gonna be very, like... Like... I don't know how, mu how many we'll get of this, so it might be useful to just kind of have... Uh, we need... Oh, hold on. I have some more ammo now. So we can either make more health or ammo. Hmm. <laughs> We've got a shotgun. Or we will have a shotgun. A knife. I definitely want to use this up, so... 
I'm gonna make heals. Heals seems to be the way to go. So let's go to heals. Make sure we're fully stocked. Okay, and now let's let's just make sure we save this. Just so we don't have to do it again. Because I can guarantee if we die, I will forget to redo it. Alright. Now let's go outside. I think we're prepared. Wow. I don't think we're prepared, but we're as prepared as we can be. So let's grab this shotgun. Broken shotgun. Man, I feel so much more. Ooh. Oh, we can make. Fine. Let's make some more ammo then. Let's do both. Perfect. Okay, so. Okay, so three is down. So we got. Actually, you know what? Um, how did I do that? Oh, I kind of want to make this my knife button, so let's go. At least we got our knife as a quick draw. Uh,. I'm keeping. I'm keeping this in my hand. Oh. oh god, we got music. Boys. What is this? Oh, a lockpick. Oh, can we... I kind of want to check what was in that... That thing up there. You know what? It's probably going to have something useful. Let's do it, since we at least know where it is. Um... Yeah, let's make the most of it. A little bit better with this shotgun, I'm not gonna lie. Uh, where was it? It was out here. More shotgun shells, I'm glad we came. like the the detail like come on the lighting casting the shadows and stuff is really it's just really immersive I feel like I can look around now that I kind of know the danger in this area is at least gone for now I can admire some of the stuff like the light shafts coming through. They appear to be volumetric. Um, the way that you can tell is you can kind of see the flickering happening. If these were... So you can create light shafts in a number of different ways. One way is you could just kind of create a, a transparent kind of strip, uh, a mesh, and just kind of texture it with like a, a semi-transparent texture that creates these light shafts. You're going to just kind of have that as a, a 3D model uh, and create that effect. But because it's got the flickering, we can tell that this is volumetrics because uh, because of the way volumetrics render, it renders in kind of uh, divided segments. So uh, you could kind of see that happening. If you were to like picture like a grid overlaid over the top, you can kind of start to see this kind of grid. That's the resolution of the. Um, it's the resolution of the volumetrics being shown through. So that's pretty cool. 
So there's the volumetrics. Uh, we could probably check if we can toggle that on and off. I don't want to play with settings anymore. I thought I heard a bobblehead. Football stuff. So do you reckon the son is going to be like super into football? So he's going to like be running at us and charging at us with tackling us and stuff. It's a foreshadowing. Oh, it's the shotgun that's kind of making that, that jiggle. Alright. Got a shotgun, we got some more ammo. I'm gonna kinda stick to the wall a bit. Let's see what's over here. Oh, I'll take that. We always like some heals. Else. So she kind of walked off that way, I think. Hopefully, so... That is over there. I'm ready. Knock, knock. I hear a thing. <sighs> Come out with your hands up. Oh, we got a safe area. Okay. That yeah, music. Oh, okay. Maybe it's Zoe's. <laughs> Man, you nasty checking out someone's underwear. What's this? Steroid increase- oh! Wait. Wait. Oh, is this what the keys, uh, the coins are for? They like, unlock this? Hold on, what's this? Uh, health upgrade? Increase max health. Okay, so we can unlock some more health upgrades. Is that what this is as well? Wait, this one's different. F. Stabilizer. Hold on. Reloading speed increased indefinitely. Well, we just got a health upgrade. Do we do the reload speed? I don't know how often we use the gun. Alright, let's have a look around. Before we make a decision. This fridge. Well, this fridge at least looks somewhat somewhat clean. Like, these cans are definitely old. So you got bleach? No, you got bleach in the fridge. That's off milk. <laughs> okay. Well, I mean, it's better than the... the onion... soup spilt everywhere. One. Ooh, gun! Oh, broken. Oh, we already have a handgun, so... I don't know what we're going to use that for. What's this chick? Oh, wait! The, there was that thing that said, um, the, the hippie chick? Is that what this- is that Zoe? So Zoe's like a hippie chick. Yes, let's save this. I thought this was the mother's, um, Trailer, so maybe this is Zoe's trailer? Let's grab out the coins, because we might buy something. So it's kind of like, it's like a shop, almost. You know, probably come back here. Oh, maybe this is how she called us? You reckon? Hmm, okay. 
Oh, we got another VCR thing. I don't have... Oh, we got that mirror tape. Can, wait, can we play that again? Oh! Another coin. I'll take that. Oh, we got another one. What's this? Uh, 44 Magnum. A lot of kickback. And a lot of stopping power. Ooh, is that like a pistol upgrade then? Okay. Why do we have a broken pistol? It's broken, but it could be repaired. Is this better than the one I have? Uh, G17. Broken handgun. What's this? Yeah, see, this is the family. We got the father, who's now dead. There's the son, who's grown up, and there's a girl. So that's probably like Zoe, right? And then you got the mother. The mother doesn't really look like the mother. <laughs> ah. Okay. Yeah, you know, I think we get the... I think we get the reload speed. Oh, so we can we could probably like split them across if we wanted to. Nah, I'm just gonna go full. Give me that. And one more. Oh yeah. Take that. Stabilizer. Let's use that. <laughs> now I don't get the shakes as bad. I'll be honest, <laughs> I couldn't tell the difference at all. Sure, it's probably faster. Alright, uh, let's see what we can store in here. Got the key in here, let's put the coin back until we get some more. Uh, what is this? Gunpowder to make handgun ammo. We don't have any M stuff here. around. Put gun shells. Put that there. Let's put the broken gun away. So I don't know what we're gonna we're gonna use that for. Uh, so yeah, so we'll put that there. And alright, let's Well, hello there. You made it. You're the first I've ever seen make it this far. So what is it you need me to do? Oh. Is okay. it going to help me get out of here? Yeah. Yes. Now listen carefully, Ethan. My family and I, our bodies are contaminated. I can't leave the property unless I get it out. And the same goes for Mia. Is there a way to get it out? We need the serum. It should clear whatever this stuff is out of the body. As long as you're not too far gone. <sighs> All right. So where is it? If I knew where one was, I'd already be long gone. But I have a feeling my mother has hidden some inside the old house somewhere. Wait, she has it? get this thing. I can help me and we can get out of here? Right. And so can I. The old house is near the water. You can't miss it. All right. The old house? I just hope you can handle my mother. Your mother? Be careful. <laughs> They'll be looking for you. Told ya. She's the next boss. So, we're gonna get it, but it ain't gonna be right, or there's something's gonna happen, and then we're gonna have to deal with either the cop or. What's it called? Alright, let's go. Actually, let's quickly save. I can't remember what we did. Get three dog heads, go out to the escape the house, get the yard. Is this the new one? I can't remember. 
Main house. Well, uh, new save. Make a new one. Just make infinite. I hope there's a limit. Oh. Floors. I don't know what she said. I forgot. Oh, I forgot. Hold on. Do we have any? Search the old house for the serum. And it was near the lake? That's what she said? What's this? Oh. Oh, we got some more stuff. Uh, supplements. Pills that affect the nervous system can be, uh, can, can't be used as is. Uh, make them into medicine first. Oh, okay. So we got like two cards that we have to get. There's like card swiper things. Yeah. Oh, okay. Oh, wait, hold on. It's upstairs. <laughs> Go try and have a little peek. And that leads up to back to the house. Okay, so are we gonna get locked out here? So this becomes our only way back in. I don't know. The gate here. Up from the other side. Okay, so we're gonna go out that way. We're gonna somehow make it back here. Gonna have to run. And, okay. Okay. Just preparing myself for the inevitable time we have to run and whatever. Anything over here. Oh. Hey, we got a coin. Oh, if I can get another one, I can get the health upgrade as well. What's this? Uh, separating agent can be combined with some items to separate the chemical fluid from them. Info. Oh, I can make those uh, pills now. Oh, okay. Alright, let's store that because I don't know what I'm going to use that for. Probably not. We're probably going to need some inventory space. There, that in there, and put that in there. Alright, now let's go. Now let's actually get to doing something. I think I didn't see that. I saw it. I'm just gonna put it in here. I don't think we need it just yet, so let's just go like that. If we need it, we got it. Alrighty. Oh god. Ah. We have to... Oh, this is what where Mia was, wasn't she? Before she got grabbed. Oh! Okay. Ah, yeah, this is. Oh! Get out. That's a big ass bug. Hey.
Why are the bugs so big? I thought it was like a fungus thing. Is it like infected the bugs as well? Hey, <laughs> that's right. I remember seeing the, the flamethrower. Okay, so best way to kill bugs is with flamethrower. Right. Oh, does it mean there's going to be more bugs? Right. Let's see. I think this way. Ah. We go this way. Yeah. Oh god. Oh! Oh! Nope! Nope! Don't go that way! Oh my god! Oh. Okay. We don't go that way. Close. Can you, can you close this place? Now? Thank you. Ow! Oh! We can see our health. I actually haven't checked this before. Maybe we should keep an eye on this. We got yellow. Alright. If we get if we take damage and we don't die, we'll quickly check that again. Because I think if it goes red, that's when we know to Ah, uh, say these upstairs don't go up. Okay, sure. I'm. Sh <laughs> yep, I have a feeling we have to go up. Nope, 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 nope. So if we get too close, it chases us. So do we just like avoid it, maybe? <laughs> Oh, run, 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 run. Oh. Heal. Come through, come through. Oh. And then we're close. Ha <laughs> ha, bitch. Oh, God, look. <laughs> We've been stung, our hands all messed up. Oh, shit. Okay, so this is where we were before when we were playing as Mia. And the mother walked past. That way. I want to go this way, though, because I know that there was that room. Oh! Let's check the map. I haven't actually checked the map in a bit. Guest room, dining room, entrance, living room. Oh, this is the other house. So we came from this one where we had the garage and stuff. So is this where. Is this where we started? Because I feel like. Where we started also had a, a kitchen, but this place doesn't have two kitchens, right? The incinerator room. But... Dining room... But there was like another place that had a... That had a kitchen, so is that, is that what this is? No, that's a greenhouse. Oh, this is the trailer. Keys. R. So we got the recreation room. Ooh, that's a kid's room. So that's a girl's room. Oh, what did I do? Map. This is the gallery. That's how we got outside. Wait. No. Okay, so main hall we got outside. That's the balcony. On a touring room. Oh, okay. Yeah, because this is a secret passageway. Drawing room, monitoring room. Uh, supplies. Incinerator room, a place I do not want to go back to. Ah, uh, and then... The workshop? 
Do we have a map for the workshop? So there's the supply room, that was where the incinerator room was where the thing was. Right? Hold on, let's... Oh, we just scroll. Okay. Right, I just want to get like a, a understanding of where we were. So we had the the morgue. Okay, incinerator room. Oh, the morgue is where we fought old mate, and then that leads off to. By the looks of it, under the stairs, and then there's like. Thing. We got the boiler room, incinerator room. The boiler room is where we had to run through, yet, yeah, and then we go around. Okay, and then. Okay. Incinerator room. Came in. There's a workshop room. Was that locked? Or do we not see that? Because there's... Hold on. So we came in... Incinerator... Okay, well... I guess we're going to have to go back there anyway, because we have to unlock that. So... I mean, that links back up to this part. Processing area. Okay. Getting some... Info. So, and this is the main area we got the. Um, so that leads off to a greenhouse. Interesting. Interesting. So we're gonna come back from this way. Because it, it's locked from the other side, so. Okay. And then I scrolled up and there was a kid's room, contaminated room. Detention room. Oh god, is this gonna be the little girl? She's upstairs, and I scroll up, and we got these. So, upstairs is where the girl is. Oh god. Creepy girl time. That's not gonna be fun. Alright. Well, let's continue this way. Is she in here? Nothing. Okay, well that key thing's gone. Since Mia used it, which means... So we're probably gonna need to get that again. Maybe? Give me that. I'll take that. Yep. Give me that. More ammo. Don't mind if I do. All right. Well, I'm feeling like I'm more equipped with stuff now. Okay, we've got another safe room over here. Okay. I see you. Ooh! Hell yeah! Carry more. Perfect. Alright, so I want to make some... Heels. Let's grab that out. Yeah. Oh, those don't stack. Okay. Yes. Let's make some additional heels, because we're probably going to need that. Uh Okay, so I think what's happening is we're seeing what the next weapon is going to be cuz like we found that room where the shotgun was before we could get the shotgun. So I think we're seeing we're probably going to get the um the flamethrower a little bit later, I think. Okay, so that close that. Let's have a look around. Yeah, I think we have to come back here. Okay. 
Man. Is that a mosquito? I what it is. Alright. You know, the bugs aren't as scary as other things. <laughs> I say that now. Solid fuel. Oh, that's for the... That's 100% for the... Oh, the flamethrower. I reckon we're gonna have to burn those bug nests. Oh, okay. Elf, get off. Okay, so some stuff's gonna be blocked, and I think we have to burn it before we can access it. And we go. Oh, I forgot there's another locked drawer. Where was the other locked drawer? I'm trying to remember. It was in that that other room. Um. In the kitchen. Our main hall with the monitoring room. It was in that that room. Is it the monitoring room? No, it was upstairs, that room. Grandma's room, recreation room. I don't remember. But yeah, that that room that we kept running back to. I think I think it is the monitoring room. All right. And then we went down the stairs. Oh no, it was this room. This room. Yeah, because we got a key there. Okay, so we need to remember that next time we get a lock, uh, lock pick, we might we might actually just go all the way back there just so we can see what's in there. All right, what's out here? Show me. Uh oh. Okay. Oh, we got crows. What that is? Well, we got lock pick. Like I said, if we get lock pick, we're gonna go back to that room. Alright, let's do it. I mean, we could just do this one. I'm gonna do this one, because I know that we have to go back to the house at some point, so I'm gonna... I'm gonna wait. Oh, that wasn't as exciting as... <laughs> That wasn't as exciting. I kind of regret that. I kind of want to go all the way back. Whatever. It's probably gonna be more interesting when we go back. Those are bugs. Got some mangrove roots by the looks of it. So we have to burn some bugs to activate something. Oh! Burner nozzle. Okay, so we, we maybe we do assemble the, the flamethrower now. That way we can navigate. Okay, can we, can we build it yet? Solid fuel. <laughs> Did we make more deals? 
Oh, wait, but we can use the... Okay, we need to go back to that storage thing. Because we can, we can separate stuff with the... With the blue one. So I think... I think that's so... In case we craft something, we can uncraft it. Alright. Let's do some crafting. Don't touch me. Ow. 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 You motherfucker. Run. 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 Oh. Ow. Damn. So I think we're half health. I'm gonna hold off for as long as I can to heal, just because I'm I'm curious to see how much the bottle heals. Oh wait, no, it's this way. Grab the this. Yep. And let's uncraft one of them. There we go. Perfect. Solid fuel. Turned into liquid. It looks like it can be combined with something else. Well, probably with this. So we go this and this. Oh, and it comes with. Oh, it comes with fuel as well. That. Will I burn myself? <laughs> I think I just burn myself. All right, I'm ready to burn some shit. <laughs> All right, so let's just heal. Took a bit of damage. Back to green. Okay. Okay. Perfect. <laughs> oh, wow. Okay, so when there's still smell, so we got more. What do we get? We got red. What is this? Strong chemical f uh, chem fluid. Can be combined with other items change their properties stronger than normal okay so maybe make stronger heals all right well let's put this back in the storage and we got a shotgun and we got a flamethrower back to uh, 
Let's put this away as well. So we have a little bit of space. Uh, we got these hills. Um. All right, you know what? I'm gonna save it, and we're gonna end the episode here. It's not like this one wasn't a like super, uh, I th like, what do what do you call it? A super intense episode this time. So, uh, I think that's because we just did like a lot of uh, high adrenaline stuff in the last episode or in the last part. So there's like a little bit of uh, changing up in pacing. So it gives you a little bit of breathing room between the the high intensity bits which i really like um uh games when they do that you know they're, they're thinking about the player they're going to kind of like pace you through it they're not gonna um you, you don't want to do that to your players kind of have the same thing because one it can get a bit um boring like if you have like lots of the same stuff throughout the entire game uh, obviously it's going to get boring, so you kind of want to, you want to change up the pace, so you have like a section where you're fighting, a section where you're puzzle solving, and like that sort of stuff. Uh, so that's kind of where we're at right now, we're at kind of like the puzzle solving stage. Uh, we get the flamethrower, and we got the shotgun. I don't know what, um, what enemies we're going to run into, but, uh, I'm assuming we're going to need both of those. Now, I think the flamethrower isn't going to be so much a weapon. It might be. But I think it's going to be more puzzle solving, at least for now, and then maybe later as we start to deal with more of those like those guys that are like uh, the the black gooey guys. The, um, maybe fireworks on them if it is like the symbiotes and Spider Man. Maybe. Um, so I think we might use be able to use that for that. Which would actually make sense, because there was the, the furnace, and the guy was, like, put in the furnace, um, according to that letter, so, uh, fire might be a good thing to fight them against, oh, fight against them, so, we got, we got some pretty good weapons, so it'd be good to test them out, um, I don't think, oh, actually, yeah, maybe, because we've kind of, we've got guns, uh, there's the pistol, so I think like the pistols and stuff will like slow them down. Uh, shotguns might like really slow them down, so you got like mid range, and then maybe you get the the flamethrower, they'll actually kill them. So maybe I don't know. But if you guys enjoyed this episode, uh, it was a little bit uh, less intense this time. Uh, leave a like and all that sort of stuff. I have a feeling it's kind of been. We have one episode where things are kind of intense and then the next episode things are going to be kind of like more puzzle solving so i have a feeling in the next episode we're going to be running for our lives again so uh stay tuned for that episode if you aren't subscribed already please do hit the subscribe button that helps me out a bunch and also notify you when i drop the new the next video so stay tuned for that um and yeah, actually, also, in addition to that, uh, the first episode of Nightmares from the Deep, The Siren's Call, has probably just dropped uh, just before this video. So, uh, that's a brand new series. Uh, that's the second in the Nightmare from the Deep uh, game series. So, it's the second installment. So, if you like the first series, uh, go and uh, check out the second series. Uh, already uh, playing uh, playing through it uh, the the visuals are updated and, and all that sort of stuff um, we got full full HD resolution um, and they're really cha they're like uh, by the looks of it they're adding more and more puzzles just off the bat so we've got more stuff to do so um, I'm already enjoying that so if you guys want to see that uh, jump over check out that first video it should already be out and the second video will be coming out um the following the wednesday of this this one comes out on sunday i release these on fridays for you guys in the states uh saturday for me uh so yeah every saturday another um uh resident evil and every wednesday tuesday wednesday for you guys uh i think it's tuesday if you're in the states uh wednesday for uh, for myself, uh, a nightmare from the deep. 
So we've got two game series going on at the moment. So if you're interested in either of those, definitely go and check them out. And yeah, don't forget to leave a like as well and all that sort of stuff. And I'll thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you in the next episode. So thank you guys so much for watching and catch you then.